Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how I do my eyebrows. I'm going to use two different products and I'm basically going to show you a comparison between um, the e.l.f. product which is a more of a low-end product and the Anastasia products which is more of high-end. We're just going to do like a side-by-side -side comparison between the two. I usually don't wear both of these at the same time. If you want to know how I do my eyebrows, then please keep on watching! For today, I'm going to use the e.l.f. eyebrow kit and this is in dark and we're going to be using the gel side. And to fill in my eyebrows, I'm going to be using the Sephora brow filler in the, sorry, in the number 100. I don't know if you can see here, but I have really sparse areas here. Um, compared to this eyebrow where it's fuller, this is really sparse. So what I like to do is draw a line here to kind of indicate where I want the brows to start. Just by using like a really light hand, we're just going to draw a line there and kind of connect that to the front a little. And I'll basically start filling it upwards very lightly. And then I'll start drawing like my tail area. And once I get to the front, what I'll do is fill it in but really lightly. So taking the brush without picking up any more product, I'm just going to basically fill it in like really, really lightly in the front. Now to clean up the uneven line, and today I'm going to use the Maybelline Instant Age Remind Eraser. We're just going to clean like the areas here. And to darken up my tail a little bit more, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Coal Eyeliner in Brown. And this is a really pigmented product and I wouldn't recommend anyone filling in their eyebrows with this because it's basically like really dark. So what I'll do is I'll just dot where I want the products to go and then I'll go in with the brush again without any products and I'll basically just blend that upwards towards my eyebrows or wherever I want the products to go. And so to darken up my tail a little bit, I'm just going to drag that to the tail and a little bit towards the front. That's basically how I do the left eyebrow using just e.l.f. products. In the Anastasia Brow is in chocolate and I'm just going to use this slowly and, and brush out my eyebrows. And using the pencil side, draw a line like under my brow but very lightly with a very light hand. Just start filling in the top as well and lightly draw out the top of the eyebrows and then connecting the tail as well. Okay, so I basically drew like an outline and to fill in the brows, I'm not going to fill in with the brow whisk because I kind of like to use the pencil to just outline because it's so much easier. But to fill in, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in chocolate. And now to clean up that part that I just messed up on, I'll just go ahead and take concealer and sculpt out where I want my brows to go. I'm gonna go back in with the brow whiz and just draw in the sparse areas. And then I'll just fix up the front. And now what I like to do is blend everything that I just did so it doesn't look too drawn on and I'll just blend the front and then towards the ends a little that doesn't look too bad okay whatever's so yeah as you can see um, both sides both look the same you can barely tell that there are 
two different products on my eyebrows, which is a really good thing. I just basically wanted to show you guys a comparison between the two if you're looking to buy a high-end or high-end or low-end product. Um, they both like look the same, they don't feel the same or work the same, but they look the same, which, you know, you can't beat that because no one's gonna know that this side is using just the Anastasia product and no one's gonna know that on this side I use some e.l.f. products. I hope that you got like a really good glimpse between the two. I like to wear the e.l.f. product on a daily basis because like ain't nobody got time and money to go out and buy like just like those two Anastasia products and they're really expensive like by the way compared to like $3 you can't really beat that. Um, I'll wear the Anastasia ones if I'm about to go to like a really important event or like just anywhere really fancy or like a big party or a wedding maybe. I just prefer the e.l.f. more because it's way cheaper and like even though it takes me a while <laughs> to get it right, it's it's okay. As long as my eyebrows all look the same and I'll feel like that, that's all that matters. But yeah, I really hope that you got a really good glimpse of the two products side by side. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye!